My name is Hans Verhulsen. I am uh, the founder and the man behind Lulin Tees. We're a UK based company, and uh, our goal of the company is to bring the best uh, of Chinese tea back into the UK. I think what, what makes our business model uh, different from many other tea importers or import export companies is that we have a very intense collaboration with our Chinese partners. They're not just our producers. Uh, they actually fulfill many roles for us, going from actually sourcing the products, doing the quality control, which is very important, uh, and doing the packing as well as the shipping uh, for our uh, online website, uh, where we sell directly to consumers. For us as a company, it actually gives us a lot more um, competitiveness to actually compete with American, European tea companies because our shipping costs, we can actually deliver teas in five days for pretty much the same price that many of the local companies can do, just because we ship directly from China. So we have now actually set up with our Chinese uh, associate, a company locally in Shanghai. Um, he deals mainly with the day-to-day -day relations with our suppliers. Uh, but we make a point that at least uh, with every new tea harvest, when we actually do the buying of the tea, that I go out there as well personally. The main breakthrough was for us last year when we were working on a big cultural event in, in Belgium uh, called Europalia, uh, which Europalia is a cultural event that happens every two years. Um, and we were asked to provide them with the tea and all kind of merchandising. Um, and it was a big success in the five to six months that it runs. We had 1.5 million visitors. I think our, our biggest USP is probably that we control the whole production. Um, we have control literally what we say from picking to pouring. Um, we can guarantee and pinpoint on a map of China exactly where, where the tea is coming from. We inspect those farms as well, we know that they are organic, that is fair trade. We have all that knowledge. Setting up a company in three different, langu in three different countries with three different languages on a small scale as an SME, of course, is, is, is very difficult and we can say now that we have successfully achieved that and we're looking um, very optimistic for the next year.